So let's see that chapter nine. See, so nine. So this verse is so important. Sarva Dharma is only one time. <laughs> it's not opinion. This is Sri Bhagavan Vacha. Your your opinion. This is Praman. No, but the main devotee. I, oh, well, I I I I go by Shastra. You quote Shastra. Any vox pop. It's called vox populi. It's called Lokvichar. Lo, that's that lok means lokik. I'm speaking a lokik praman. Shastra praman is a lokik praman. You're speaking lokik. Lokik. This is Bhagavad Gita. That's not the essence. I'm also speaking Srimad Bhagavad Gita. Manmanabhavamad Bhakto. I think you should read the Gita a little more tightly and you'll understand. So the ninth chapter, Rajavidya Rajagulyam, ends with this verse, same verse. And then that's ninth chapter, and then the eighteenth chapter repeats it again. And there, he, first he says, "This is the secret." Then later he says, "What I told you before is a secret. This is the secret of all secrets. This is Bhagavan." So you, you, if you disagree with Bhagavan, then you're a Gnostic. Oh, many Brijvasi pandas say, many Goswamis say, I say pranams, none about karo. I don't accept it. I reject it. I stand by Sri Krishna and my Guru Parampara. This is the essence of Gita, and any Acharya who knows Bhagavad Gita will say this is the essence, because that's what Bhagavan himself is saying. Sarva Gyotamam. I already explained to you. If you just give up, that's 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 called that's ne- there's nothing positive there. Tyag. So now what? That's you're giving up everything, but what are you accepting? Doesn't say any doesn't talk about acceptance. So how is the the essence of Gita? He says, give up Dharma and then accept something. Accept me. Your verse only... Yeah, the essence of Gita is to give up Dharma and Varna. No, that's what he says in 934. He already discussed Jnana Yoga and he says, this is it. Think of me. And then he discusses... And he dips from nine, chapter 9 to 18. He, he reviews again. Krishna starts reviewing again about Gyan Mark and Triguna Mai. And he talks a little bit about Gyan and Yoga. And then again he repeats, forget all that, just to drive a point home. First, and then he says, this is the Sarvagu Yatama. With all respects, Panaji, I don't accept it. And no, no Acharya that knows Gita will accept what you're saying. Mahaprabhu rejects it. Mahaprabhu rejects it. The whole Gaudiya Prampra rejects it. Where, listen, where, where, where does Lord Chaitanya reject this verse? I'm asking a prashna. Where does Lord Chaitanya reject your Praman, 1865? God, Bhagavan, Sri Krishna Chaitanya, who spoke Gita, he rejects 1865. What is 1865? Sarvadharma Pritajya. No, that's 1866? 1866. 1866. So 1866, that's your Praman. Lord Chaitanya rejects it. So my question is, where, what, where is the Praman where he rejects that verse? Is my, you understand my prashna? Hindi Bhakaro. You're saying all the Goswamis and Pandas saying Sarva Dharman is the essence of Gita. Lord Chaitanya disagrees with you, disagrees with all the Pandits, and he's Bhagavan Sri Krishna. And I'm asking you, where does he do that? Uh, I don't know the date. I'm not asking date, I'm asking Shastra. Janane? Ne Janan. Ramananda Rai Samvag. Chaitanya Charitamrita, Madhya Chapter 8. Go ahead. <laughs> so he, not a Hindi people. He said, "This is ex." He said, "He said this is external." You say it's the essence of life and the essence of bhakti. Is bhakti? <laughs> so 
Think of me, worship me, surrender to me. 